Scott Bode here with Steed Autosports to talk about our top five S197 performance modifications. Now, you have your 05 to 09 cars with the three valve, and then the Coyote came out in 2011, so those mods maybe are a little bit different, but these are my personal top five mods for your S197. All right, starting on number five, since there's a million Mustangs out there, you want to stand out from the crowd. So the first thing you do, let's lower the car, right? Let's get some Steeda lowering springs, but you have to remember, you have a pan hard bar on these cars. So you're going to need an adjustable pan hard bar to keep your axle centered in the rear of your car. When you lower it down, it's going to swing out to one side. You don't want that. If you're running wider tires, you might get some rubbing and things like that. But ultimately, a set of lowering springs is not only going to make the car look better, but it's going to put a smile on your face. Every time you go put it in the corner, go out for some spirited driving, it's going to instantly respond. It's going to feel firmer in the turns. Our Steeda springs are known for not sacrificing the ride much at all. And the car is going to look great in the process. So Steeda lowering springs and adjustable pan hard bar. Number four on my list, we're going to stay with the aesthetics. Everybody that grew up in the 80s and 90s know that one of the most popular hoods ever for the Ford Mustang was the Cobra R hood. It had great lines. It followed the body lines real good. We came out with one for our S197s back in early 2005. And to this day, it remains one of the most popular modifications you could do to change the look of your car. Also incorporated into the Steeda Cobra R hoods for the 05 to 09 Mustangs is air extraction from the back. So what that's going to do is going to lot out a lot of the hot air that's coming in through the engine compartment and let it out at the base of the window. Keep that engine run a little bit cooler, get you more performance, but also has great looks at the end of the day. Number four, Cobra R hood. Number three is exhaust. To this day, I still think the three valve is one of the best sounding exhaust systems there is out there. They crackle, they pop, they bang, they sound really good. But once again, you got your looks, you got your hood, you got your uh, lowered stance. Let's make the car sound better. Let's give it some growl. At Steeda, we offer a wide variety of cat backs, axle backs, high flow midsection pipes, you name it, both for the three valve and for the Coyote. In the Coyote's case, you got those four valves of cylinder, so you want to make it breathe better. Open up that exhaust. Now you got that nice deep tone, especially if you go with something like an H-pipe. And once again, something that's instantly going to put a smile on your face, the consumer, every single time you fire it up. Okay, number two. We got a little bit of the looks, we got a little bit of the sound, but we got to still look good, right, at the end of the day. The older cars only came with 17-inch wheels from the factory. Once you start getting a little newer, they had some 18s and 19-inch options. But at the end of the day, nothing fills up a wheel well, reduces that gap, than a 20-inch wheel combination. You have so many different tire sizes, from our friends at Nitto Tire and Mickey Thompson, where a set of 20 inch wheels will really set the car off, make it look good, still offer a great ride. You got plenty of fender room in there. Now that the axle's centered with the pan hard bar, get yourself a good set of wheels. Even our new 19 inch Trident wheels, they looked outrageous on this older S197. Pick yourself up a set of 19 or 20 inch wheels. That would be my second to last modification if I was the owner of one of these awesome vehicles. Coming in at my number one mod, we got some styling, we got some better handling, we got the wheels, we got the springs. We need more power, right? We need the power. Well, thanks to the aftermarket, we've got multiple options. You can start off with a cold air intake, you got a little bit more power out of the exhaust, but Let's just go straight to the blowers, right? You could have a Whipple. If you got a three valve, I always suggest the Whipple. 
It gives you a bunch of good low end torque, a lot of grunt, makes great low end power. It screams, it's got that whine sound. And if you've got one of the newer Coyotes, I'd actually suggest a Vortec supercharger. Well, why a Whipple on one and a Vortec on another? Well, it's quite simple. We want to take advantage of the platform. The three valve was not considered a very high revving motor. Well, most roots blowers don't rev very high anyway, right? They make a lot of good low end torque. Stick that on the three valve, but with the Coyote, get yourself hands on a Vortec or a Paxton, maybe even a Pro Charger, because why? These motors love to scream. The more you wind out a centrifugal supercharger, the more boost it's gonna make. Plus, depending on your driving habits, the centrifugal style might be even better because you're just not gonna be blowing the tires off the thing at every stoplight. You're gonna actually be able to put some power to the ground, and as the RPMs increase, that thing's gonna be pulling like a freight train with a Vortec on there. So that's what I would do. Those are my top five mods. I love these cars. This has been labeled as one of my favorites to this day. It really is. Can't get enough of the new Coyotes. Ford kicked it out of the park with that. And you know what? At the end of the day, it's your Mustang. You go to Steeda.com. You can make it look any way you like it. We got so many different exhaust kits, hoods, spoilers, wheels, tires, you name it. It's the beauty about being a Mustang owner. You'll never see two that are identical. And when you got yourself an older S197, whether it be an older three valve or the newer five liter Coyote, you can't go wrong. So get yourself some parts, visit Steeda.com, check out our Instagram, our YouTube, our TikTok, follow us on social media. And remember, ladies and gentlemen, Steeda, where speed matters.